a challenge. That is why I didn't okay. want to talk. Yes. And the NDC says, why are you not downsizing the size of your, uh, Why are you not so downsizing you your, your appointees? Yeah. You have too many appointees. You say you've downsized it from 126 to 86. The NDC says it's still not enough. But my question to you, uh, mm -hmm. Sami Jenfi, are you um, playing double face to Ghanaians if you really wanted uh, government to downsize its appointees? Why didn't you utilize the opportunity that was given to you in Parliament? Well, More than 30 of members of Parliament of NDC voted to support the extra nominees of the Trust president. Trust me, Samuel, no answer that. Uh, you, let you, let you, me first of all deal with the blatant falsehoods that Nana D has. You have made. three and a half all, minutes to do that. First of all, Nana, you have not just been in office for 2017. So when you are comparing uh, sectorial performance, oh, it is non stop. No, because he said industry. They did this for 2016. We did this. No, 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 no. That's what I did. No, Acha, you, you are here. Time. Let me make oh, my point. It was a period. I mentioned Please. the period. Mm. Industry grew by 4.3% in 2016. Mm. In 2017, because of the two new uh, oil fields that came on board, it went up to 15.6%, right? It came down to 10.5% in 2018, 6.4% in 2019, negative 2.5% in 2020, they will say, because of COVID, mm. but negative 0.8% in 2021. And last year, industry grew 2022 by 6.0. Now, that is the broad sector. Come by, to the subsector. By 6. Ca yes, 6. 6. 6.0. 6. 6. So it appreciated. Come to the subsector. It appreciated. Yes, come to the subsector. No, you are quickly trying to run away from the, 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 the fact okay. that it appreciated. Yeah. Which is very critical under industry. Yep. Because now you are mm -hmm. taking, you are not looking at just the oil and gas sector, which falls under mining and quarry, but manufacturing. 7.9 in 2016 under President Mahama. What was the growth rate for 2022? 4.5. In fact, in 2018, it was 4.1. 2019, 6.3, 2021.9. Now it is 4.5. Okay. And they are projecting that this year to be 2.2. Mm. So if we pick manufacturing, 7.9 to 4.5, which is further projected to go down to 2.2, who has done better? Mm. Construction, we did 8.4% in 2016. They did 5.1% in 2017, 1.1 in 2018 before COVID, negative 4.4 in 2019 before COVID, 3.1 in 2020 during COVID, 5.7. Then this last year, 4.2. And they are projecting that construction sector will grow by 1.5 even in this year. Okay. So who has done better? Mm. Services sector, 2.8% in 2016. But check the growth for 2022, 2.8. Mm. And 2023, what is the projected growth? 1.7%. Mm. So agriculture, 2.7 under NDC 2016. What was the agri growth for 2022? 0.7. Mm. What is the projected agri sector growth for 2023? 2.6. So every sector, your performance is the most abysmal because you guys are hopelessly incompetent and you are mismanaging the economy. Number two, they say that there are hardships everywhere because of COVID-19. This is a chart of inflation rates in Africa. Mm. And you can compare. Mm -hmm. Ghana's inflation rate of 52.8% mm. for last month is the third highest in the whole of Africa. You so have one minute, so you have to finish that, and answer that question. No, you gave him a lot of time, so you are going no, to... Jam is not time. Another time it's 3.5 each. I, he's, I, he's it's he's that, I think you, you, you've, you've confused the timing. He's I, actually, I, no, no, you started. started. I should be <laughs> ending. No, no. I started number two, you. Number two, <laughs> this argument about rate of debt accumulation is a fallacy. He shouldn't stop making that false argument. The most important thing about the debt stock of every country is whether or not that country is able to service that debt. Mm. And so whether or not your mama increased Ghana's debt by 1 million percent is not the issue. Mm. Your mama was able to service Ghana's debt. In 2016, tax revenue was 26.7 billion. Mm. Our debt service was 14 billion. Meaning that we could use just about 50 percent of our tax revenue mm. to service our debt okay. and still have some left. Mm. The percentage of our debt to our GDP was only 56%. Today, the percentage of our debt to our GDP is 103%. And you can't service our debt such that you are imposing cruel financial haircuts on people who have lent money to you. And you are here talking about rate of debt. So, so why didn't you utilize again, the opportunity again, to, to help government cut again, down the size of government? you don't pay taxes to the NDC. So when we are discussing important matters like this, 
which has brought the country on its knees. Let's discuss it and stop shifting, you know, responsibility. Ghanaians don't pay taxes to the NDC. Mm. At least you had over 98 or close to 100 NDC MPs voting against the, the, uh, 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 the ministerial nominees. Mm. You had 136 NDC MPs Aja, voting against responded. the so social taxes. That is something yeah, you must comment. Not, not a single soul in the MPP voted against those okay. ministerial nominees so, or those social taxes. He's chosen right. to before be I chicken. Conclude, I mean, before I conclude, let, you, let so before conclude, I conclude, and I'll come to Before you. I conclude. Mm. You see, they claim that um, they've cut expenditure. Again, another fallacy. What was the expenditure Actually, for I think 20... That, I think that my, don't my, don't my worry, I'll give you your time. I'll give you your time. My, what was the expenditure for the year Tell me 20... Tell for me. I'm wrapping so up. That I can, what was the expenditure respond. for the year 2022? Eh? The expenditure for the year 2022 was 136 billion. 2023 expenditure projected 190 billion, an increase of 54 billion. Goods and services has increased from 5.8 billion to 8 billion. So what's your and point? And allocations to the office of the president keeps, I mean, it's increasing every year. Mm -hmm. They are not cutting down the expenditure. They are spending recklessly. They are looting state resources. Mm -hmm. The Auditor General's report is clear. It is not only about the buffer stock matter. Okay. There isn't ample time either than that. I would have demonstrated that to you. Okay, clear so Aja. About how they paid Aja. about 17 million for food right. with no Aja. receipts to show food. Let, how they paid about 37.6 million for free water. Let, 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 me allow, no, let me allow that, that to so show respond. For. I, will not say, say, I will not sit. I will not sit. Oh, no, no. Sammy, Sammy. Sammy, Sammy. Sammy, Sammy. We are running out of time. Is it Aja? I will not sit. I will not sit on this platform on COVID-19. For, 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 for,